Jones, he is expected to set the tempo. And these rivals of the past start yet one more game. In the slot. Got in the way of that one. Laid on to Nylander. Takes that pass. Swept on to Marlowe. Pad save. Puck is thrown to Pacioretty. A shot and a save. Shoots one. And still another save. What a show to Drouin. And on top of that, another great stop. Play is stopped. So let's hear from our man at the ice, Ray Ferraro. These teams haven't liked each other forever. It's really interesting to watch a rivalry game when you see that the coaches are fired up, the players are fired up, and the fans are here early because they want to watch it all. Many thanks, Ray. Turned away with a stick. Is able to move on in. Right into the slot. What a reaction save. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. And he puts the glove on it and stops playing. A little under six minutes play. Still knotted at zeros. Toronto's got a defensive zone win. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. It's dumped in. Pitching it to Petrie. Steals it in the attacking zone. Crosses that line. Impressive effort there. Tremendous job done defensively there with a poke check. Lifts one. Robbery there. Looks to make a play. And he gets it back. They've got it going right now. Can they finish? Fires. That one gonged him. Need to get rid of it. All the pressure still on as they can't clear. Big pad save. Looks like it's a matter of time for the Canadians. They're getting all organized now. Looking to Hyman. Toronto's up the wing controlling play now. Slides it to the point. Save to Deneau. Snapping a pass to Domi. Let's it go. Good save there. Carey Price has owned one of hockey's most pressured jobs. Goaltender for the Montreal Canadiens. Great size for Carey Price. Six foot three, 210 pounds. You talk about a pressure job. Maybe as tough a job in the National Hockey League to be the starting goaltender for the Canadians. Watch out, a big hit. I don't know what you guys thought, but I sure suspect that this would be way more physical. That's one of the rare hits we've seen tonight. He won't avoid. You know what, Doc? Instead of acting like this after the whistle, how about both teams play whistle to whistle like this? And play is stopped for a penalty. The teams have coincidental minor penalties. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. Chip to Zaitsev. Off his pad. And now it's directed to Pacioretty. On to Marner. Fires! Terrific challenge. Outstanding save. A missed opportunity from this close in. Let's it go. Great save. Point blank. Puck loose, just a speed bump off the defense. The poke check worked. On the outside, a shot. Turned away with the stick. Montreal's in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. Snaps one. Save. They get it out, and that is a relief to the coach and the players. Great take, dangerous area. Routine save, but a necessary one. players came to the boards boom take it over again Riley's got it on his stick trying to clear not enough to get it out inside the final minute of play a 
shot off the face mask. Back on his stick. Riley is tripped, and a penalty should be coming. Toronto's got their man over on the delayed call, and the goalie rests at the bench. The Canadians have been handed a minor penalty for tripping. And Toronto's got that face-off win. First period has been completed, and we are as we started. Nothing, nothing. We are in the early stages of this game, about to begin the second period. Your thoughts on the first? I know we don't have a goal in this game yet, Doc, but you got to give the goaltenders some credit. There were some quality chances on both sides, especially some of the second and third chance opportunities. Good use of the stick. Broke that pass up. Trying for it. Terrific save with no reaction time whatsoever. What a great scoring chance in a slot, but the goalie got on top of that in a hurry. Great glove save. Pass attempt to Riley. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Let's a shot go. That puck hit him on the way to the net. And a save. Rister from the slot. He scores. gotten a one goal lead and lots of time left in the game we're still in period number two the Leafs control from the neutral zone lots on that to Nylander great save goalie's one of the six guys on the ice he can pass he did that nice play with the stick nothing more will come what a hit that was oh he's been looking for that hit all night Got his stick on it. Moved along and in. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Slid to Hyman. Dogged determination there by Alsner. Trying to go to Domi. Good job done with the stick. Way to break up that play. Maybe can change the tide at center ice. Propelled to Deneau. Back in his defensive end to get it. Fires a shot. Good save there. Toronto's in the neutral zone along the wing. Alone. Oh, terrific save on a great chance. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. Oh, what a glove he's got there. Just over eight minutes have been skated so far. Toronto's got the lead, 1-0. The Maple Leafs with a face-off win. A great speed bump set up there. Missed it over the net. Shifts to the backhand and shoots. Blocked. Out at the blue line. Possession in the zone. Puck controlled now by the defense. Steps across that line. Biggest chance of the game. He shuts him right down. Looking for options up the wing. He was outnumbered, but not outskilled. Let's it go. Some contact there, and the puck is loose. Directing that one to Kapanen. Passing one off now to Kadri. Sails it. Used that big goalie stick well. Let's a shot fly. Just above the crossbar. That's a prime area to score goals. He was there, but just did not execute. At least he protected his goaltender. Drives it. Marvelous save. A great chance was no chance. That one is pointed to him. Rugby and hockey together at the boards. In with it now. One on one. Score! One is tied. Well, 
that certainly changes the complexion of the game. That tying goal has changed everything about this one. The Canadians have fought their way back into this, getting it tied before the end of the second period. Coach's words in the intermission, and an exciting third lies ahead. A smart recovery by Petrie. Oh, how quickly did that change? A very fast shift in power. Toronto's broken the tie late in the second period, setting the stage for a wonderful conclusion to this, and then a full third period ahead. Moving it to Ennis. Steals that pass at center. Oh, broke it up. And now we'll get the penalty call. The Canadians are getting a minor here, and the call is slashing. Oh, that's a blatant slash, Doc. Anytime that you slide your bottom hand up your stick and swing your stick, you're going to the box. Toronto's to the power play again, and they have rung in one already. Let's see if they get another. They've been successful before, Doc, in the game here. Let's see if they can do it again. Move the puck, get the puck to the net. The Canadians are boxed on a tripping minor. Every game presents a fork in the road opportunity, and this is it. It's a long five on three power play, and it begins now. And that one's sent back out. And it's a good pickup. Gains the zone. From the slot, Arister. Big pad save. Still more time killed as they have to drop back and regroup. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Toronto's along the wing at center ice. A shot, outstanding save. What magic even to get there and get the shot off. Glove save, trapper save, doesn't matter, Doc. That was great. A shot, gets a blocker on it. Collected in the corner. Outstanding save by the goalie. The Canadians are skating it up at neutral ice. Montreal's done a wonderful job in killing off an incredibly long penalty. While well, they had some success, or breaks free. Save! Couldn't have handpicked a better guy to be on a breakaway, and he stopped him. Wonderful save. Two periods are in the books here. And the books could very well have some perspiration stains on it by now because these teams have worked pretty hard. But still, a third period is ahead. Let's take a look at the two period shots on goal. So third period about to begin. What did you think of the second? The Canadian stock trail going into this third period. They have to start converting some of those chances that they've had. The time of possession has been in their favor, but they're still down. Opening face off of the third period has started it. Shoots one. Oh, what a break. That shot hit somebody. Gathered up again by Brendan Gallagher. That play is offside, and so back to center ice for the face. The Maple Leafs control at center ice. And at an angle to Nylander. Let's it go. Wonderful save. Buck loose now picked up. The battle for possession continues. Nice work with the stick. Poked it right away. Pitching this one to Matthews. Points it. Terrific determination by Pacioretty. Taken and held at the blue line. Wonderful stop. Puck covered. Whistle blown. Nice face off work. Laid on to Hyman. Two guys together with force. Big force. Oh, he thought he had more room to slide by him there. Nope, he got thumped. Puck is thrown to Hyman. Carries it on in from center. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. The Leafs luck that along up the wing. Oh, and he is drilled. Got it at the point. 
That's a goaltender's best friend, a defense in all alone. Oh, what a save on a marquee name there. Piked in the slot. Oh, marvelous save on a changing tip shot. Puts one on. Save there. The Canadians wheel it up the wing. Let's it go. Block it away. Shoots one. Good save there. To Kapanen. I know lots of people like high-scoring games. Well, actually, I'm one of them. But this has been almost like a well-played chess match. There's no room. There's no way that either team can find a way to get many more chances than there's been. Just couldn't find the target. That's a tough one to watch. Need to practice hitting the net. Wonderful chance was set up, and the pass just goes wide. Muscled off. Takes a shot. And he missed it. Perfect wrister. Turned away. Moves to the corner. Fires. Just fired it wide. Threatening an attack. Oh, up and over the net. This is textbook hockey by the Canadians. Takes a shot. They score. And they've tied the game up. The Canadians have gotten an enormous goal, tying this game and a bumpy ride to... here in the third. Toronto's collected another victory on the faceoff. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Good place to shoot from. Got the save there. They won it. Now what can they do? Can he generate something? What a heavy hit! Pacioretty's often been talked about as a 200-foot player. That means using your bot. Score! The Canadians have broken the tie here in the third period. What will they do next? How will they start to play this game? Aggressive? Passive. Toronto's winging it at neutral ice. Worked along in the corner by Marlowe. He wore that puck on a hard shot. Save! And holds on to that puck to get the whistle. Price has been under siege almost the entire night, but he has stopped just about everything thrown his way. His team's leading this game as a result of his brilliant play and some timely goals. And a save! Okay, they've got the face-off win. What's next? One minute left. We are in the 60th minute out of 60. Took that away in his own zone. Shoots one. You can almost count that one, but no, what a save. Centermen practice this so many times at the end of their game day workouts. And here comes the biggest one, perhaps, of the whole season. Let's it fly. Pad save. Ooh, tough one there. They won that faceoff. Can they clear it? What a hit. Riley's not very happy after taking that huge hit. He wasn't aware who was around, and he paid the price. Let's it go. Deflected off the blocker. Toronto's gating in their own end, trying to get to the neutral zone. 
Tries to get it on net. Great save. Toronto's pulling their goalie, saying, take a chance. Why not? Net empty. He scores. Toronto's got that puck off the tie-up. And he dumps it in. Pitching it to Drew in. Let's it go. He was standing in the lane and caught some of it. 45 seconds. Game over. It is a calculated risk that you have to take in the sport of hockey. You may be trailing, but you've got a chance to at least tie it up by pulling your goalie. When you do that, you have to get the goal scorers out on the ice just.